Herbalife. Ooh, Cambridge. Ooh, Weight Watchers. Slimming World. Ooh, clean eating. I know a lot of people like this. When it comes to dieting, they're like fucking magpies. They see the new shiny thing and they're like, ooh. And this is why no one ever sees a result, because they don't stick with one protocol long enough to actually see the fucking result. Newsflash, guys and girls, every diet works. Every one of them. If you adhere to them long enough, it doesn't matter what one you choose, they all drop body fat. Every one. And there are three reasons for this. Number one, as mentioned, the attention deficit diet. People see the latest fad and they go, oh, I'm going to try that instead. Oh, I'm going to try that. Number two, they get bored. Some of these dieting protocols, like take clean eating for an example, or paleo, fucking boring. You're not allowed anything with flavor in. Everything's got to be bland. Everything's got to come from the sun and from the earth. And you know, that bollocks. Or three, they don't see results quick enough. Now the funny thing about going into a diet is, yes, it's the adherence part, yes, it's the consistency part, but even someone like myself, I need to know a diet's working relatively soon after beginning it. Not just from feeling better, but I do need to see the scales drop, I do need to see my clothes get looser, and I do need to see the double chin fuck off. And this is why when I'm first working with a client, yes, I'll try and get them to lose weight on as many calories as possible, but at the same time, I will put them in slightly more of a calorie deficit to try and nudge that along a little bit faster because those first couple of weeks on a diet are gold dust. If you can get a good loss at the beginning of a program, it's gonna just reaffirm your reasons for doing it and reignite your enthusiasm for that diet. And we're all the same. For the hunger, for the work that goes into a diet, we all want to see a result relatively quickly, or at least just have a little, yeah, it's working, don't worry, keep doing your thing. And for all of these reasons, folks, this is why I lean towards a diet which is enjoyable, because if you enjoy it, you're going to keep doing it, and if you keep doing it, you're going to see results. So it boxes off all three of these things. The only one that sometimes comes to crux is when someone sees a shiny new diet, when their friend is losing a shitload of weight doing the Cambridge diet, and they go, oh, I want to do that because they're losing loads of weight, and you have to kind of reaffirm to them the reason why they're doing this protocol. You've got to play the long game, guys. It's tortoise and hare situation. If you are the tortoise, you will win eventually, and the hare will burn themselves out, and they'll fuck off over here finding the new shiny diet. If you truly want to see results, find one protocol, one diet, and stick to it. Then adhere to it consistently for no less than 10 weeks. If you don't see results in a 10 week period, you're clearly doing something wrong. And during that 10 week period, you'll pretty much figure out if you like that approach or not. In my opinion, the best approach, don't diet, change your habits, change your lifestyle. Weight loss is a side effect of the lifestyle changes. Don't die.